Hello. Well, the government is introducing a new antisocial behaviour law to replace the ASBO. The planned replacements will be called IPNAS, Injunctions Preventing Nuisance or Annoyance. However, the threshold is so low and the safeguards are so weak that many civil liberty campaigners say the new laws are a real threat to free speech and legitimate protest. Well, the Christian Institute has teamed up with others to form an alliance in opposition to the government's plans. And joining me now to discuss this issue is Sam Webster, our in-house solicitor advocate. Sam, thank you for taking time to come and chat to us about this. Uh, what are your general concerns? Well, chiefly, what we're most concerned about is that the bill would create powers for the courts to make orders in relation to conduct which some people may find simply a nuisance or annoying. And in the words of Lord Macdonald QC, the former Director of Public Prosecutions, the legislation has uh, uh, very shockingly low safeguards and has very low threshold for granting these orders. So we're concerned that all manner of ordinary situations could be caught by these order-making powers. So then Lord Macdonald, the former head of the uh, Public Prosecution Service, um, has done a legal opinion. Uh, does he give any examples about the kind of activity that could be caught by this? Yes, he does. Um, I mean, three examples that Lord Macdonald does give in his legal opinion um, are ones which um, are, are very symptomatic of the sort of thing that could happen. So, for example, a busker in a shopping centre something that we see you know, a lot uh, around, which uh, uh, um, most people would not simply see as, as a problem, but some people may, may find annoying. Uh, what about a street preacher um, in the public square? Or what about a lone protester holding up a sign outside a bank, holding bankers accountable for the financial crisis? So it's not hard to see all manner of situations that could be caught by these new order-making powers. But antisocial behaviour can be a real blight on people's lives. I mean, surely you're not against the government seeking to tackle that? Sure. Um, antisocial behaviour is undoubtedly a problem for many in our country. Um, but let's not forget that there are good laws already in place for the authorities to use if necessary. And perhaps one of the key areas for antisocial behaviour is the area of housing. But there are already good order-making powers. And um, we're concerned that the government uh, need to tackle this problem in a sensitive way, given the need to balance the needs of human rights, of freedom of expression in a democratic society, with the, with the requirements also that people should not be, um, suffer undue offence. Uh, so uh, what kind of changes would you like the government to introduce? Well, given the very low threshold that there already is in these order-making powers, there are several or a series of amendments that, that simply could be made to the legislation to raise the thresholds, but also um, further safeguards could be added to the legislation. So, for example, under the current ASBO regime, it is a defence for the person, the subject of the application to court, to show that they had acted reasonably in all the circumstances. There is no reason why such a reasonableness defence could not be added to this bill for this particular order-making power. And what's the time scale on this? I mean, where is the legislation currently at in Parliament? Well, currently the, the, the bill is in the House of Lords where peers are scrutinising the provisions. Um, the bill will probably pass its Lords stage uh, in the early part of next year when it will obviously return back to the House of Commons and then proceed to royal assent. So there is a good window of opportunity there for the bill to be amended and for many of our concerns to be allayed. Well, thank you, Sam. I'm sure we'll all keep our eyes closely on this. And if you would like more information about this issue, then please do visit our website, christian.org.uk, where on the front page you'll see a link through to the Antisocial Behaviour Bill where you can get more information.